And I saw a star fall from the heaven unto the earth, and to him was given the key of the bottomless pit. This is loyalty in the last days. I'm outside of Birmingham University on their open day. We're going to ask some of these professors, some of these PhDs, a few questions to share the gospel. Why we're doing it? Let's go. In the Hebrew tongue is a button, but in the Greek tongue has name Apollyon. Uh, given the scale of the loss of human life in Gaza and in Israel in such a short amount of time, the Secretary General has today delivered a letter to the President of the Security Council invoking Article 99 of the Charter of the United Nations. This is the first time that Antonio Guterres has done this since he became Secretary General in 2017. Article 99 states, and I quote, that the Secretary General may bring to the attention of the Security Council any matter in his opinion that may threaten the maintenance of international peace and security. But of the times and seasons, brethren, ye have no need that I write unto you. For yourselves know perfectly that the day of the Lord so cometh as a thief in the night. For when they shall say, Peace and safety, then sudden destruction cometh upon them, as to veil upon a woman with a child, and they shall not escape. But ye, brethren, are not in darkness, that that day should overtake you as a thief. Ye are all the children of the light, and the children of the day. We are not of the night, nor of darkness. Therefore let us not sleep as do others, but let us watch and be sober. In the letter which has been shared with you, the Secretary General urges the members of the Security Council to press to avert a humanitarian catastrophe, and he appeals for a humanitarian ceasefire to be declared. If ever there's a time for you to wake up, trim your lamp, make sure your fire is burning, it is actually now.